What's going on y'all? Thanks for tuning in again. For those of y'all that are new here, my name is Keith Carver. I'm owner of Brothers Outdoors Hunt and Fish and Supply Store, which you can see here behind me. We are located out here in beautiful Sarasota, Florida. And today's chore day. Beautiful. Not here around the shop, we're doing it the fun way. We're going to the woods, filling some feeders, checking trail cams, seeing what kind of pigs we've been having moving through the area. And maybe, just maybe, if we get all of our chores done, we might be able to find a way to sneak out to the tree stand get a little hungry this evening. And you know I had to say something about that awesome Brothers Outdoors Edition no seam camo shirt I got on. Big old Mayaka buck we got on the back of there. They did an awesome job with this shirt. Make sure you guys check out the website. They got a ton of great stuff that you can buy or you can have some custom made t-shirts just for yourself. All performance gear, long sleeve, short sleeve, you name it, they can make it happen. Feeders are filled and there's plenty of light left in the sky, so it's time to head out to some of our favorite spots, do a little feeder jumping before we go sitting in a tree stand and see if we can't kick something up. Alright, we are out here walking around the property. Sure enough, one of these Moultrie cell cameras goes off. And we got us a big old boar hog sitting up near camp, so got some new trails that were recently bulldozed in through here. Try and slip up the back door here on this big pig. See if we can't stick one in with fancy new raven. Let's see that raven. Let's do it. Now my buddy Mike was using that brand new Raven R29 sniper combo. And man, that is a slick machine and I am fired up to see what this thing can do to a big old wild South Florida boar hog. Let's see it. So we get the Moultrie notification on my phone. Big hog under the feeder, perfect timing, let's go. We scoot over there, get into position, 
And just as our luck should have it, right as we're lining everything up, the feeder goes off and this hog spooks back and we gotta start all over from square one. Ah! Well, unfortunately, this hog never made it back into that same shooting lane. Uh, we had to reposition, we had a bunch of swirling winds, and he ended up catching us, whether it was nose or he saw us. Either way, he busted on out of there. Scratch one up for the hogs, and a zero for us. Let's keep on. So we make our way out of that hammock and not 30 minutes go by and I get another notification from another one of my Moultrie cameras set up on a feeder. Guess who it is? Yeah, it's our big target hog. If y'all been following along online, you've seen this hog causing me some problems for quite some time. Flipping feeders, he always seems to have a leg up on me. Well, we got him under the feeder now, so let's see if we can put a spot stock on this thing. Lucky real Florida hunting fishing hat must have done it. Contact finally got this big old boy hog and put the slip on me for weeks. Mm. Well, looks like third time's a charm. Got busted twice out of here. Put the stock on two hogs. The wind has not been friendly to us. It's been swirling like crazy. And finally come down here to this uh, the soup kitchen we call it. Been after this hog for a minute. And we just put a good stock on this thing. Got up to what, 40-ish yards? 38, 40 yards. Mike put the money shot on him with that raven. Heard him go down over there, thawing, throwing a little bit on the ground. So we're gonna, uh, we're gonna start the track job and see if we can't find old boy. Where does every hog go before they die? In the thickest stuff imaginable. I don't, we might not have to go far today. No. There's a lot of blood on the ground. You see him? Real good.
Well, there's nothing quite like a spot in stock, and out here in beautiful South Florida, we were lucky enough to get it done once again. I took an awesome walk this evening with my buddy Mike out here in the woods in Arcadia, came across this giant boar hog, and finally got the deal done. Ended up coming across a couple hogs earlier. Uh, wind has not been in our favor, but hey, we are able to play it right this third time. Got it on in this old warrior, all scarred up. Got some cool blonde coloration at the back here. Man, that Raven crossbow definitely did the job today too. It through, absolutely <laughs> put it out. No doubt, that blood trail made it pretty easy. Well, make sure you guys swing on by the shop next time you're in the Sarasota area to get stocked up before your next hunting or fishing excursion. Check out Brothers Outdoors and make sure to hit that subscribe button. We appreciate you. Once again, another beautiful day down here in South Florida, out in the woods, enjoying what we love most. Big thanks to my buddy Mike for coming out, bringing that sweet Raven R29 out, taking her for a test drive and seeing what she can do against a big old South Florida boar hog. Had a great time out there. Make sure you guys hit that subscribe button. And next time you're around the area, swing through, check out our shop right in here in Clark Road in Sarasota, Florida, or check out our new online store now launched. You can go to brothersoutdoors.us and check out all this great stuff we got in the shop. It's now online available to you. Thanks guys.